fellow bookquestas, this is I, Aranda Bookquesta, to introduce you to this almighty book, Sculptory Pleasant, book two, Playing with Fire. Don't try this at home. So this book is about like a uh, Sculptory Pleasant, the skeleton detective, and his newfound apprentice, Valkyrie Kane. Once known as once known as Stephanie, once known as Stephanie, she now has her third name, the name that will protect her other names, that she will not be controlled easily by any other malevolent creature. When a through when a new threat looms over the world, another prop to bring the faceless ones. The dark gods who will, uh, will, who will change the world and, well, basically almost destroy it, I guess. The, another plot for that. Remember about the, uh, so there was a sorcerer, a very evil sorcerer who started a war. And he had his infamous three generals. The first book, I didn't mention this, but at the first book, the villain was named Serpine. Serpine. Serpine was the first of the three generals. The second was much was Baron Van Genis, and the third was Lord Violet Necromancer. And as you can see, the second book's villain is the second general, and his name is Baron Veginus. He is trying to get the Grostikari, an unkillable monster that is made out of pots of creatures, most of it a faceless one. He is trying to bring it to life. He, he just needs two ingredients. One, a necromancer's power, and two, something too shocking to even mention. And so, Skaldry Pleasant, Valkyrie King, the end of the world. Oh no no no, they have to stop. So they go out on and she starts hunting down Baron Veginus with their trusty sword sword maiden friend Tanith Lau. And together they are trying to stop Baron Veginus from awakening the evil Curry, the beast that will bring the faceless ones back into their world. They must stop that at any cost. And as the time ticks on, the the lunar eclipse draws nearer. The lunar eclipse, the time when the Curry will be able to bring the bad guys back onto the earth. And that is quite dangerous. So yeah, they go to stop it. And as they go, they t and on their final mission against the Grostiker, they take Mr. Bliss, one of the most powerful individuals in the world, and the Cleavers, the army of the Sanctuary, a kind of magic council. And the Cleavers, kind of killer soldiers, I guess, killer soldiers, uh, 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 that kind of thing. And they are trying to stop the Grosker. And in the final battle, Baron Veginus and Skulldry Pleasant has a mutual showdown. And finally, all is good. But but a new thread they can feel. Because there's something behind the scene. Something mysterious and not necessarily on their side. Could Scottery Pleasant and Buckley Kane save the world and the, and the next time turn out victorious? That is for you to see. And like always, a bookquester and the bookquester. Gotta go, my friends.